Um, okay. Uh, one other thing, I guess, just real brief, but um, for anyone that was curious about it, I, I went to go see a movie last night. I went to go see The Machine, which is the uh, the Burt Kreischer comedy movie that is about, uh, if anyone's familiar with him, he's the comedian that takes his shirt off. He's really high-pitched in his laughter, and, and he talks about how he got involved with the Russian mafia when he was in, in college, and this was basically a movie version of that. Um, and it's one of those things where it's like for years I've been hearing the story and about it and everything and like getting to see that converted into a movie is like a wild experience but even more insane than that is the part where somehow for some reason they got Mark Hamill to play his father and you're just like yeah it's the guy Van Wilder Why? Was based off of exactly I don't and it's just like I don't know how you got fucking Luke to show up the Joker himself <laughs> <laughs> but he's soup he was on board and he yeah he's in it as his dad um and i i, I think i found that afterwards it's because like i think his like his son or his daughter was like like someone well, his kids were fans and they basically were like hey you should check this out and they showed him the story and then he thought the story was really funny and he was like yeah okay sure i'll go do that um i think it was something like that a bit of a raw julia playing bison situation where, you know, the grandkids were like, you have to do Street Fighter. And he's like, oh, God. And then it was his final role. <laughs> and he killed it. You know, he did amazingly. But anyway. Um, so, yeah, they got, they got, they got fucking Mark Havel to, 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 in this thing. Um, and, yeah, it's just, it's an R-rated comedy. And it's just, it is stupid. It is just, like, effortlessly dumb. And and so you, it, so you you saw that instead of Spider Verse? Yeah, I'm kind of sitting here yeah. also confused. <laughs> uh, well, I'm probably gonna go with the wife to see Spider Verse. Uh, but in this case, I just went with Josh. So um, excuses, excuses. I yeah, see well, you know, some, <laughs> yeah. sometimes the media we want to watch is is locked behind a marital contract. <laughs> There's a delay. I know, I know this. I know this pain very well. There's a fucking delay that you have to deal with that is like... That was on the forum that you signed where yeah, it was like, all Spider-Man <laughs> media must be seen with me. You know? Um, so every once in a while, that that's, that's that, that movie gets grayed out from the selection, you know? It's, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but... Um, I feel you. <laughs> but in any case, though, um, yeah, no, it was, uh, it was just like one of these things, too, where like, uh, yeah, goofy comedy movie, but it was also like um, it was supposed to come out a while ago, but seeing as it involves hijinks in Russia, uh, mm -hmm. it was kind of delayed in its release, uh, you know, understandably there. So, um, anyway, I just, it's one of these things that was just like, it's, it's as stupid as it, it plans to be and ends up like, it has some moments, it's kind of mid- but if you know him in the story, it's you can enjoy some of it, you know. So it's kind of one of these. It's like it's like if you know what's up and if you know going into it, then like yeah, go go check it out. But if you're just looking cold at a at like a you know for a random comedy, it's like eh, yeah. Um, but shout outs to Mark Hamill just being like in his. I don't need to act anymore, but yeah. You can fucking get me interested in something and I'll show up for it and then He's sell the sh fun. Yeah, <laughs> I'll have fun and I will kill it in whatever role I'm doing because I can probably just go and ignore scripts for the next 10 years and then maybe, you know, something else might ca catch my interest or maybe it won't, you know, like he's in that part of, his, of his, his career now. Like he's like, I did the Joker. I crushed it. Um, I'm good. I'll just talk about how good comics are. You know, and just get super in on that and, and, and have fun with, with whatever he wants to do. So, yeah, that, that's a machine. It's called the machine because um, the premise of the story is essentially that uh, uh, he went and Bert Kreischer went to Russia as a stu as a student trip. And um, part of their and this was in the early 90s. And part of the the way to get around Russia safely back then was the students had to hire or, or rather the school would hire a Russian mobster as a protection person, essentially, to as a guide that would be around. So they'd have like security, but security was just the the fucking it was, it was, it was a mobster. Crime. It was just a, yeah, it was a, a banditi, right? And so, um, 
he basically was like, oh, these guys are they're partying and drinking and they look like a fun time. Let me, let, let me you know, go see if I can uh, 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 hang out. But he didn't know any Russian, obviously, because he was just like a dumb fucking whatever, like dropout. And he kind of uh, learned one phrase, which is supposed to be he's learned how to say I'm a badass. But if you mispronounce it, the word for badass sounds like the same word for machine. So he op when he knocked on the door to the mobsters and they're all drinking and partying and he's like, they're like, what do you want? And he just said, I'm the machine. And they're like, get in here, say that again. And he just went, I'm the machine. And everyone was like, ah, this guy, what the fuck? He's a machine, which it is, which is a whole other thing, because to them, it's like the most absurd thing ever, because it, it's much more literal. You know, mm -hmm. like like your everything you say is is supposed to be much more direct, and so anytime you do something like that, it's absurd. So they're like, "Wow, this crazy American!" And then he just started partying with them, and from there it went into a fucking crime heist nonsense adventure. Um, so his nickname became the Machine, and then he tells that story on stage, and then everybody uh, uh, knows it as that, and that's why it became his name, uh, and that's huh. why it's the name of the movie. Um, I am the machine. Yeah, that <laughs> Just, looks so confused right now. Yeah. <laughs> it's 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 a whole it's a whole it's a whole. Why thing. does he take his shirt off? Yeah, that's the question everyone wants to know. <laughs> oh, is that? Oh, okay. Oh, that's I the, see. That's the billion dollar question. Uh, why the fuck does he take his shirt off? Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's it went viral like years back uh, on Facebook and and around. So you know, you might have like been like, oh, I might have heard that at one point, you know, type of thing. Seen that guy? Why has he never got a shirt on? Never got a shirt on. Never. That's his brand. His brand is I'm gonna show you my fucking my moves and my dad bod and my gut. He's just he's got the hang going. It is what it is. Okay, um, put your shirt back on. Nah, never. <laughs> he, he won't do it. <laughs> 